Hi there, welcome back to this channel. In this lesson, I'm going to teach you how to delete easily image in Cloud Genery. As you can see, I am currently logged in in my Cloud Genery account and I am in the products folder. As you can see, I have only two products image. And let's demonstrate that. For example, let's create a new product named Laptop. Okay, description lower Mipsu. Price, um, like so. Choose a category. I have only one, and I'm gonna choose an image. Okay. Um, okay, let's choose uh, this image. Okay, and now let's create product. Okay, as you can see, product created successfully. Okay, and now I'm gonna um, verify that product. Okay, so now let's verify this product in uh, our Cloud Genery. Okay, so first of all, let's see if the product image was currently uploaded. Let's refresh. And uh, sure enough, let's see, go to Y. Okay, this is our product image right and now let's try to delete i mean this product and also with its image in the cloud generic account okay now in postman let's verify our product okay so i'm gonna get all products remember we have available pagination okay let's send the, the request Okay. Um, okay, let's go to page two. Okay, because we have implemented, uh, I mean, uh, two products per page because we don't have uh, that much products. Okay, but you can implement, I mean, as much as one um, product per page if you want. Okay, um, just for demonstrate. Here, this is our product. Okay, laptop. Okay, this is the price we gave. Okay, and this is our image. And now I'm gonna try to delete. Let's grab this product ID. Okay, and now I'm gonna go to delete product. Okay, I'm gonna pass the ID here. And now let's send the request. As you can see, product deleted. Okay, success true. And now let's go back to Cloud Genery. Okay, because we delete this product in our database and also the product image in Cloud Genery. So let's go back in Cloud Genery to verify that. And now in Cloud Genery, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna refresh, okay, this product folder, okay. And as you can see, guys, sure enough, our image, our product image was deleted. So that's what I'm gonna teach you right now if you are new to this channel consider to subscribe and hit the notification button to receive our last videos with that being said let's begin now in our code editor let's create a, a new product controller to delete i mean uh, um, the product and uh, the image to do so i'm gonna just copy the last one last controller okay and paste here okay let's add a comment and delete product and product image in cloud generic okay so here i will name it delete product okay pagination i will need this okay this also Okay, uh, we are cleaning. Okay, and also this, but I'm gonna go back. But let's, um, I will add the image. Okay, um, product. Product deleted. Okay, like so, and uh, here, I don't need this. Okay, so uh, this will be one product, await product, find by ID, 
by id and now let's pass uh, as parameter request that uh, params that id like so okay so um now i have uh, the product id okay i will use it to grab I mean uh, the cloud generate image id okay i'm gonna show you um so add a comment i mean retrieve current image id okay so um i'm gonna um i'm gonna show you in the cloud generate okay in the postman Okay, let's go back real quick. Okay, in get all products. Okay, here, as you can see, let's check um, one. Okay, as you can see, I have products, image, public ID. Okay, so uh, I know how to find, um, we know how to find, I mean, the comment, um, Cloud generate uh, image ID of the product. Okay, now let's go back real quick. Okay, and um, okay, now uh, pause. Okay, image uh, ID equal, I mean, uh, product, this product dot image that okay public public id like so now i have uh, the id of the cloudinary image okay so i'm gonna delete i'm using a single weight okay ordinary ordinary that loader that destroyed okay this method will destroy um the image ID and now let's pass the e image ID in between like so okay after that uh, I can delete okay um, the product now I've deleted the, the cloudinary image ID and now let's delete the, the product okay in MongoDB cons okay remove product okay i'm gonna just to save some time copy this paste here okay now find my id and delete like so okay and let's remove some space i think uh, that's it for now okay save and now uh let's copy okay this for the controller because we need to add a while to delete um this product okay let's go to wilds folder and for the cloud here i'm gonna duplicate this one and this will be delete delete and now uh products forward slash delete and the id like so let's import i mean uh, the controller delete product okay and passed here but i want only admin to be able to delete i mean a product to do so that person should be authenticated okay and also he should be an admin user okay and now doing so let's see okay after doing this i'm going to create a new product and after that delete it in uh, um, our mongodb and also in cloud generate okay now before testing let's create a new product okay to do so i'm currently logged in as admin user and now let's say um laptop uh, i mean Dell, I mean, whatever name you want to give, Prime Okay, price, let's say um, 
100, I mean, uh, 150, okay, that uh, 99, okay, choose category, I only want electronics, and let's choose uh, the, the image, okay, and this is our laptop image, as you can see, okay, and I'll, now let's try to create a new product. Okay, as you can see, guys, I have my new product created. And now let's check, let's verify in Canary. Okay, so I'm gonna refresh the product folder. Okay, let's refresh. Okay, and as you can see, guys, I have um, my new product image. Okay, and also a new product is created in uh, the MongoDB database. But the focus is to remove. Um, to delete also the product in the MongoDB database and with also this image. Now, let's go to Postman to remove um, this image. Okay, now in Postman, okay, let's get all the products. Okay, um, let's send the request. Okay. Um, I have two pages. I have uh, two products per page. Okay, count three. I mean, uh, our uh, last product will be in the page two. Okay, send the request again. As you can see, one product here. Okay, and this is our newly created product laptop Dell, Bababalo, and if so, this is the price that we give. Okay. And now um, I'm going to grab the product ID. I need only the product ID. And now let's go to delete. Okay, here I'm going to, so as you can see, the what is API because I prefix all my what with API. I've created product, delete, and the product ID, right? Okay, here this is uh, our product ID. Let's try to delete. Okay, as you can see, success false. You must log in, I mean, to access this resource. Okay, um, and also you have to be an admin, as you uh, have just seen. Okay, and now let's try to sign in real quick. Okay, as admin user, send a request. Okay, currently um, sign in. Let's go back again. Okay, to delete this uh, product. Okay. Okay, as you can see, success true, message, product deleted. Okay, now um, let's go back to Cloud Generate. Okay, um, first of all, let's, let's me demonstrate that, uh, let's send again the request. So you see on page two, we don't have product. Okay, let's go back on page one. Okay, as you can see, I have only two product. Now I have one page, okay. As you can see here, and I have count two. I have only two products, okay? Before I have three. I mean, our product was deleted. And now let's check in uh, the cloud in array, okay? So uh, let's go real quick, okay? Now, the, that is, uh, this is uh, the image that we, up, that we have uploaded, okay? And now let's refresh this products folder. Okay, sure enough, guys, we have successfully deleted the product in the MongoDB database and also in the Cloud Genary, guys. Hope you learned something. So if you like this video, please leave a thumbs up. Okay, if you have comment, please drop it in the comment sections. Share this video to your friends. And uh, the more you like this video, the more it helps with YouTube algorithms so that more people can see the video. So with that being said, thanks for watching and see you in the next video. Bye-bye.